Hello, Pensacola. Are you ready to take our country back? Yeah. You know, I want to thank you all very much for being out here today. We've got a big job to do. We got to make sure we get our votes out. We got to make sure that we elect Mitt Romney as the next president of the United States. Yeah. We got to make sure that uh, that you help me beat Senator Nelson. about big things, big ideas. This campaign is about how do we move this country forward. Now, Barack Obama and Senator Nelson, they believe in something different than we believe in. They believe in a government-run health care. They believe in a stimulus package that has failed. You see, they believe that more government is the answer to our problems. No. Mitt Romney, Marco Rubio, and I believe in something else. We believe in free markets. We believe in free enterprise. And we believe in free people. We owe it to our children, we owe it to our grandchildren to fight this out and make sure that we put America back on the track, back on the road to prosperity. <laughs> Mitt Romney has got a plan, Mitt Romney has a vision, and Mitt Romney has the strength and, and conviction to make sure that America is the strongest, continues to be the strongest nation on the planet. I'm asking, you, uh, I'm asking you for your help. I'm asking you for your support for Mitt Romney. I'm asking, you, I'm asking you for your help and your support for me to be Senator Nelson. With your help, we will make sure that Harry Reid no longer controls the agenda in the United States. help, we'll make sure that Marco Rubio is a chairman of a committee in the United States Senate. And with your help, we'll make sure that Mitt Romney is the next president of the United States. Thank you, Pensacola. Thank you very much. Now, you know today is the first day of early voting. So when you're done here today, what are you going to do? Oh. You're going to go out and vote. Then you're going to call your friends. You're going to call your neighbors. You're going to call your family. No matter where they are, tell them to get out to vote. So um, it's now my honor and privilege to introduce someone that needs no introduction. Our, our Senator, Marco Rubio. I've never seen so many people in one place for someone that can't sing. <laughs> Listen, thank you so much for being a part of this. I want to first start by thanking you for something you did a couple of years ago. I want to thank you for allowing me to have the privilege of serving you in the United States Senate. When I got to the Senate on your behalf, I walked into one of those first meetings, 